VTS V Auto, how y'all doing? Let me get myself together. I get excited when I'm working on Mr. Lofton car. We back at it. It's a long, you know, wait that's happened, but I'm proud I got the support, you know, to keep you guys abreast of what's going on. For those of y'all been following the channel, salute. You already know we did a lot of metal work to this car. Uh, this was a car that was purchased without knowing that the amount of rust work that it had. You know, so we did a lot of work to the car. We tubbed it. Um, we also added the trunk floor braces. The other floor was rotted out. We had to salvage some more braces. We had to hand make these other braces here for the body mounts on the car. Um, as you can see, we still cleaning up the metal. We gonna, now we back on it, we can kind of like really focus our attention. We had some more work and we was had some couple of parts delays. If you remember, we did the frame on this car where we actually added all the frame stiffening kit. That was a nine month wait. And that was the you know next phase before we can kind of go ahead with anything else. So now that we got the kit done, we back on the car. We finishing up the metal work that we you know little stuff that had to be done, little wells on the bottom and stuff that wasn't complete that needed to be finished up, welded up. But we knew once we got underneath the car, we could finish that stuff up. Some of the quarter panel when it was welded to the back drop drop downs here can be finished up and trimmed and cleaned up the right way. So. Far from finished, but a lot of work done. And we so excited because most of the bad stuff is done and out the way. Now we back at it, we finna clean it up. This is gonna be a real nice car when we done. I can't wait to show it to you guys. Pete, you know, just, you know, you got a 12 inch lip in the back. We tubbed it. You know, we got some new look going on. I don't even wanna kind of reveal that yet till we get the parts and stuff in. But stay tuned guys. Look through the, you know, the, the work. TZ gonna flash some. Some, some before and after, you know, things that we did in the past, you know, obviously he got the quarters, we did the tub, we did the trunk, we did the floor. He, he went with the patch pans um, on it, but that was before we actually was receiving whole floor pans in, but only the, you know, just the, the floor pans were replaced, everything else was good. Now we're just going to finish just polishing everything up, buttoning up all the little well spots, grinding down the little areas that needed to be done. You can see the seat belt part was put in now. Everything is flush on the back side. Your seat belt goes in just like the factory. But we've got a lot of cleanup, grinding, and wells to do on the back. So stay tuned. we back at it. VTS Viado, Loft and Much Love, Big Boy, and then Clearmont. So we got you, baby. Stay tuned. Let's go. Hey, Vic. Mr. Lofton. How you doing? Did I catch you at a bad time? No, no. Yeah, so um, real quick, you know, I heard you came into the shop. I kind of, I'm, I'm hype about the kit that you got from, from Speed Tech. I kind of wanted to know your thoughts. The guys told me some things that you've seen that you did like and you didn't like. So let me know what you think about that. Hey, yeah. Um, initially, first, first off, thank, thank you guys for the work you've done so far. The great work on the car. No doubt. Appreciate it, my brother. I, I see that the, the frame has been put together very nicely. Uh, the only thing that caught my eye, I a member of the frame was kind of like sticking up, sticking out past, I think it would be labeled the... Um, the rocker panel. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And I noticed Sorry. that... Yeah. I noticed that when I looked at it as well, but, it, you know, with the car on the lift, it kind of was almost normal, but it's good that, you know, you did come in and you have that, you know, that, that good eye as well, like us, and you notice that. So, there's a couple ways we can fix it. You want it to disappear. You want it to where the bottom of the car, it, it's, you know, I remember you brought it up before. You said you didn't like to see exhaust that was hanging. How do you feel about that? Yeah, actually, yes. I, I, want, to, I want to kind of be like seamless. I wanted to think like this, you know, that this kit was, you know, I know not a factory kit. Right. But the thing is like, it's kind of confined and kind of like hidden underneath. Right, right. Profound. That's what I like, you know, okay, well. And VTS Auto, you know my brother, our job is to deliver what you're looking for, what you want, and Red is already looking at it. He had a couple words with you where his mind is already trying to like figure out what's the best way to go about doing it. We will, you know, put our thinking caps on to get our measurement sticks out and figure out what we got to do to kind of deliver that. Cause I agree, I agree totally with the look, with the type of car that you building with this car, you know, like it's not going to be the 10 things that we did right. 
going to be the one thing that's overlooked. So it's good that you caught that. Let us get on it. Let us get to it. And we'll see you some videos and progress as we go. And it'll be good to see you again. You know, come out, look at it before we go to the phase of painting and getting that frame already pretty, which will be the next phase. It's probably be good for you to get one final look at it once we're done. And then you tell us what you think. Okay. Well, I appreciate you guys as always, man. Thank you and your team, man. BTSB. All right, I see that name on that that shirt right there. Give me, give me the, give me the name. I see the acronym. What does that stand for? It was NACS, uh, New Horizon Construction Services. Oh wow! About a week ago, we just turned seventeen years old. Oh wow! We're in my contractor here in Central Florida. We have about sixty-five employees. Uh, building that I'm in right now. Uh, we own it. It's a 40,000 square foot facility. Obviously, I'm in my office right now. You really can't see it, but wow. my neighbors are Amazon. My neighbors are Niagara Water Bottling Company. My neighbors are Domino's Pizza, wow. uh, Pro, Samsung TV. Wow. So, that's what I'm talking about. We definitely, that's, that's, we definitely got to knock this one out of the box. You know what I'm saying? Big shout out, man. I, I love all the success. I told you all the time we talk is almost like I just sit down and take notes. You know what I'm saying? You're a mentor and a big brother. You know, I'm always appreciative to do work for you, and we're going to get on it. We're going to knock it out of the box, my brother. No doubt. Hey, guys. Thank you. Well, hopefully, man, we'll see you soon, probably tomorrow, Friday, in person. All right. I'll, I'll give you a courtesy call. I won't just pop up. No doubt. You know you're welcome, though, anytime. Thanks, man. Be safe. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this greatness. Dude. 